All right, guys, in this week's video, we're gonna build the Possessed Pumpkin from 2022 Spirit Halloween. We bought them last year as clearance, and uh, we finally got a chance to go ahead and build them. Let's go ahead and check them out. Tonight, the night for fright! <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. All right, it is time to build the Possessed Pumpkin. It's been since last year, so we're excited to get this guy going. You ready, Mikey? Yes, 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 yes! All right, let's go. All right, we got everything unboxed. We got instructions. We've got the base, and we also have like a speaker box. That looks like that's gonna be his legs over there. Not really quite sure what this big F is for yet. I believe that's his chest. But Mikey, look at that head, dude. Yeah, it is huge. That is the biggest thing I've ever seen. That's what she said. That's my joke, damn it, Dwight. That is absolute insanity right there. Yeah, look at your little hand. <laughs> it's like the size of an eyeball. That is just ridiculous right there. And then the hands, they do kind of look like Crouchy's hands, uh, just painted in another color. Looks like we have a couple of different pieces inside of his clothing. All right, let's go ahead and get them built. Okay, let's just do this already. All right, first things first, we are gonna start out with building the base, adding legs, and then adding the pants. From there, we're gonna start to work on his torso, his shoulders, and it looks like his chest. All in all, it only looks about, about 16 total steps here, so shouldn't take too long. All right, so we've gotten the first four steps done. Now we're gonna start to add the torso, start to work on his shoulders and what should be his chest. All right, so we've got everything completed. That actually ended up being his back plate that went on the back. Oh, I see now. Got him pretty much done. We only got about four more pieces left. So now uh, we are gonna go on and Looks like we're gonna get him dressed and start getting his hands on and eventually we're gonna just toss his head on there. Again, I just wanna show you just how big Possessed Pumpkin's head is. This thing is absolutely insane. This is so huge. This is a really, really awesome prop. So tall, so just creepy looking. All right, we got the Possessed Pumpkin all built up, and it's time to go ahead and get him going. I need a skeleton or two for my haunted house. Yours looks just about right. <laughs> Tonight's the night for fright. <laughs> Monsters have been carving up my friends for years. Now it's my turn to make a jack-o'-lantern from your head. Oh, you'll make excellent fertilizer for next year's crop. <laughs> I need a skeleton or two from my haunted house. Yours looks just about right. <laughs> oh, you'll make excellent fertilizer for next year's crop. <laughs> this is the story of the possessed pumpkin. It all started in the 1900s. A story about a mom and her poor son who had never gone trick-or-treating. She wanted him to go, so she created this really hideous, homemade Halloween costume. Needless to say, all the little boys in the neighborhood made fun of him and tormented the little boy all night. And they would eventually lock him into an old, abandoned barn. Little do they know in this old abandoned barn, an entire family died one winter, leaving spirits 
to remain. This little boy would never leave the barn that night, but it's said to this day that he now lives as the possessed pumpkin to haunt every Halloween night. Don't forget to subscribe.